Hello YouTubers, I'm going to share a tip with you that I realized my Cellrite machine had a little adjustment that needed to be made. I bought it from Cellrite about a month ago, had a couple of issues with it, um, still trying to work through a few kinks, but I realized that the stitch length plate, the adjustable black piece around that if you have this on your machine, wasn't allowing my bar to reach all the way to the top. The top guide was keeping it from going all the way to the top. And the way you can check this is just look and see that this bar, when you got it in the forward position, I have my top guide removed on this one because I was checking it to see the difference. And there was a noticeable difference in the stitch length. So, but it's a real easy fix. You just loosen the two screws, slide the plate up to where you see that the bar is touching the top. Uh, put your guide back in on the top if you took it out like I did. <clears throat> that way you can tell for sure with the guide included that it's going to touch the top. Uh, the uh, On this piece of leather I had stitched about an inch and a half down and did like a before and after and I could see a noticeable difference. Uh, if you look at the top right tan stitch about the first inch and a half, inch to inch and a half is before the last part is after and there was a noticeable difference I didn't measure to see the difference but it's a real easy fix just look and see if your bar is touching the top and if it's touching the top then you'll know you're getting your max stitch length mine I don't know if it was missed at the factory or what the deal was as to why it wasn't all the way to the top but like I said it's a real easy adjustment so it looks like this machine is going to be pretty easy to work on and, uh, do maintenance on. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it helped you guys and gals out. This is the Pressure Prepper, and I'm out.